What are zoonoses? What is the difference between zoonotic disease and zoonosis? Why COVID-19 is no longer a zoonotic disease? Is it safe to play around with stray animals? What are the best preventive measures for zoonosis? In today's video, I am going to tell you guys about zoonotic diseases and their prevention. The spread of any disease from animals to humans or humans to animals is known as zoonosis. Well, zoonosis and zoonotic diseases are interchangeable terms. Sometimes animals might carry harmful germs like viruses, bacteria, parasites and fungi that can spread from animals to humans or vice versa, causing various illnesses. Now, can you guys tell me some examples of zoonotic diseases? For example, rabies, monkeypox, Nipah virus, and there are many to be named. Let's see a most common mode of transmission in an urban setup. Look what Raj is doing. Hey Raj, don't do this. The dog might appear healthy, but he might be carrying any zoonotic diseases. Can you people tell me the mode of transmission of zoonotic diseases here? When the dog licked, Various pathogens present in the dog's saliva got transferred to Raj's hand. This is called a direct mode of transmission. Now, if Raj doesn't wash his hands and eats from them, the pathogens might infect him. What are the other means of transmission? Other modes of transmission includes when the skin, wounds, scratches of a healthy person come in direct contact with saliva, blood, urine, feces of an infected animal or vice versa. Indirect contact is whenever a healthy individual comes into contact with areas where infected animals live or roam or vice versa. Vector bone is when the disease spreads via agents like ticks, mosquitoes, fleas or any other vector. Food bone consuming food that is contaminated with excreta from an infected animal. Waterborne Drinking or coming in contact with water that has been contaminated with the excreta of an infected animal. Zoonotic diseases can happen to anyone but children younger than 5 years, adults older than 65, pregnant women or people with weak immune systems are at higher risk. Let's look at some of the preventive measures that everyone including Raj must follow in order to prevent zoonosis. After being around the animals, wash your hands thoroughly with soap for 60 seconds or use sanitizers having at least 60% alcohol. Prevent yourself from mosquitoes, fleas and tick bites. Learn ways to keep your food and water safe. Be aware of zoonotic diseases both at home and away from home. Avoid animal bites and scratches. This was a brief introduction on zoonotic diseases. Stay tuned to watch more of such amazing videos. Bye-bye.